forward to the Galway Racing Festival 2021 and of course the highlight of the week will be Wednesday's feature, the Tote Galway Play, this year worth a staggering €250,000 in total prize money. But back in 1998, Brendan Powell had the distinction of riding the first British trained winner of the Galway Plate, Amla, for Philip Hobbs. Great day, Brendan. It was. Um, yeah, they've, they've, they've brought over horses for years and years. And um, look, it's one of those, it's probably the most competitive handicap I'd say of the year. Um, I had ridden in it before for um, Kim Bailey, Tim Thompson Jones, and their horses ran well. But I suppose they just never, never had one that was probably at the right end of the handicap. And everything went right on the day for him and it just did that day. It did because it, well, I think it was a squally showers or whatever that day, came up the stand rails, came up on his own, wandered around a bit but uh, it was really a tremendous performance, but tremendous training performance by Philip Hobbs as well to have earmarked the Galway player. Yeah, Philip is a, I mean, he's a brilliant trainer, still is. He's owned by a very good friend of mine actually called um, Salvo Giannani who was a sort of a mad Welsh uh, Italian and he came over as well and uh, no, we, we'd ran him in three chases to get him qualified. He won two beginners, or a beginner's chase, a novice chase at Perth. And then he was second at Stratford. And um, he got in, he only had 9-7 on his back. But I remember that day I was going to take a lead from Adrian Maguire on Gales Cavalier. And he unseated Adrian at the second and left us in no man's land. But look, he, he was a good little horse. He's probably only bred to get a mile on the flat. But um, he stayed the trip well. and probably won too far because he never won again but um, there was a loose horse sort of chased me into the straight and I remember pushing him to the line and won a distance but uh, look it was great it was it was brilliant and Salvo was supposed to stay for two days and stay ten so he enjoyed it he enjoyed he enjoyed going he'll never forget going to uh, back to the hotel that night time at about 11 o'clock and they were only doing the second settings for dinner so um, it was a late night but uh, no great meeting memorable one fast forward to 2020 and you're part of Joseph O'Brien's team and you win the plate with early doors and Mark Walsh, tremendous performance. You speak about being handicapped with, with Amla. Early doors was the right side of the handicap last year and a very good winner. Yeah, and the, the, the ground and everything came right from, I suppose. Um, you know, he'd been running, he'd been sort of, he was still a novice over fences, but he'd, um, you know, he'd jumped well, he'd ran well a few times and the ground came right for him and uh, look, it was great for Mr McManus and, and, and Joseph. And know. he had Cheltenham form as well, which in novice handicap chases, which shows you the level of form you need to win a Galway play. Oh, without a doubt you do. And it's, it's getting tougher every year, isn't it? And, um, you know, they all try it, but uh, you know, it takes a fair horse to win it. The Tote Galway play, it's on the Wednesday. Won it last year with early doors. My personal view is that a wave to the sea could be of the same profile. Will he be targeted? Um, I suppose he will. He, he ran the other day in the Grimes hurdle at um, Tipperary. He ran well. Um, so, I, but look, I suppose we've got. Um, you know, I, I should think there's there's five or six there that probably go for it. You know, and it's a it's a it's a race. I know that uh, Mr. McManus and like you know Gigginstown, Everybody wants to win it, but um, we, we we'd have a few for them and. Uh, and Joseph would love to have another goal at it again, I'm sure. So, uh, but look, it's a long way till then, and they've all got to get there safe. They have, and let's hope everybody gets there safe. We look forward to talking to you. Let's hope it's after the Galway played, Brendan. Thanks for joining us. Lovely. Thanks for having me.